Hello everyone, in this video we will be discussing about quadratic equation questions because the weightage of these questions are around 5 to 6 marks sometimes it is 5 and sometimes it is of 6 marks and uh, for all, even for clerk or for PO and now for SO also it is very important portion so let's see and move on to the questions in this video I will be discussing around 8 to 10 questions so uh, after solving all these questions you would be very um, comfortable with solving quadratic equations so before proceeding please subscribe to our channel if you haven't let move on to the video so the question is 3x square minus 5x minus 12 is equal to 0 so the first this is the first question so this question I will be solving a bit slower so that I will tell you the uh, method in which I solve these questions okay so what I actually do is I just make two things that first is for x and second is for y so first I will solve for x so what I actually do is these are the factors that is 3 and 12 so I will break down these factors so I will write 3 3 is a prime factor it is okay 12 I can write it as 2 cross 2 is 4 4 cross 3 is 12 so I can write it like this okay so this like this I will break these factors and by rearranging these factors I should have minus 5 with me okay so I will just try that how can I get minus 5 okay so what I will do is I will just check 6 and 6 no it would be 0 and like this I will check so I will get 9 3 into 3 is 9 and 4 I'll get 5 so how would I I want minus 5 so I'll take minus 9 and plus 4 so I'll get minus 5 so, okay so like this I'll solve now we have to find the value of x so I'll write x okay x is equal to if here it is minus sign I'll take it as plus if here it is plus sign I'll take it as minus okay this is not over now the coefficient of x square is what it is 3 so I'll divide it by 3 and 3 so this would be my answer 9 by 3 it would be 3 and minus 4 by 3 it would be minus uh, 1.3 something so these are the values of x now similarly I'll solve it for y see it, it won't take a lot of time it is just I'm explaining so it is taking time it won't take let's see for uh, y we have 4 so I'll write it as 2 cross 2 and 9 so I'll write it as 3 cross 3 and I want what I want minus 9 so what I'll, I'll just check this 4, 4, uh, 3 is a 12, 12 and 3 I'll get I want minus so I'll take minus 12 and plus 3 so it would be 12 and minus 3 okay the first coefficient is 4 so it would be 12 by 4 and minus 3 by 4 so 12 by 4 is 3 and minus 3 by 4 is minus 0 0.75 so these are the values of x and y so if you are not comfortable with comparing these values just draw a line uh, number line F from this you can solve so I will mark x so 3 would be here I will mark 3 minus 1.3 would be somewhere here so I will mark minus 1.3 so this is for x okay and for y 3 would be here I will mark 3 over here minus 7.5 it would be somewhere between this 0 0.75 minus okay see now the answer for this is e because um, 0.75 is less than 3 but it is greater than 1.5 so we cannot establish a relationship so it is E so by drawing a number line it would be easy for you uh, you won't uh, do any uh, mistakes by using a number line okay next okay so here also I'll write the same thing I, I'll write here X I'll write here Y here I want 2 into 2 for this 2 and for 15 I'll write 3 into 5 okay I need 11 so I need 11 it would be 6 and 5 so plus 11 so plus 6 and plus 5 so value of x would be 6 sorry minus 6 minus 5 the first coefficient is 2 so minus 6 by 2 and minus 5 by 2 minus 6 by 2 is minus 3 minus 5 by 2 is minus 2.5 similarly I'll calculate for y it is 4 so I'll write 2 cross 2 it is 15 so I'll write 3 cross 5 and I want what I want plus 16 so plus 16 I'll get by how 4 and 15 I won't get uh, 6 and 10 I'll get so I'll get it would by 6 and 10 so y would be equal to minus 6 minus 10 first coefficient is 4 minus 6 by 4 minus 10 by 4 it is minus 3 by 2 it is minus 5 by 2 5 by 2 is minus 2.5 3 by 2 is minus 1.5 so I'll just plot it in the number line so it is um, for x it is minus 3 and minus 2.5 is here for y it is uh, minus 2.5 
minus 2.5 and minus 1.5 okay see in both the cases the value of y it is either equal to or greater than means minus 3 is less than both 2.5 and 1.5 and 2.5 so y is either equal to or it is greater than so y is either equal to or greater than x it would be the answer the option here is d d is the option for this question so like this you can solve all the question it is very easy actually if, uh, when you would do it with your paper you would be more faster than this next the third question it is 2 and 14 so I'll write x I'll write y so it would be 2 into 2 into 7 I want 11 so uh, it would be 7 and 4 it is there it is 7 and 4 so x would be minus 7 by 2 because it is the 2 over here and it would be minus 4 by 2 I'll change the sign if it is plus 7 I'll make minus if it is plus so so that it would be minus 3.5 and minus 2 okay similarly for this we have 3 to 3 6 so it would be 3 cross 2 okay we have we want minus 7 so if it is minus 7 9 and 2 9 and 2 so it is minus 7 so it is minus 9 and plus 2 so y would be equal to 9 comma minus 2 the first coefficient is 3 so it is 9 by 3 and minus 2 by 3 so 9 by 3 is uh, 3 and uh, minus 2 by 3 is uh, minus 0 0.6 so just you can plot it in the number line it is um, minus 2 minus 3.5 uh, 0.6 minus 0 0.6 and 3 so it is y is greater than x so in this y is greater than x so b is the answer for this question next move on to the next question so the next question we have 3 I'll write x I'll write y I'll write 3 for 20 is 4 cross 5 so 2 2 2 cross 2 cross 5 and we want 19 from this so let's check 6 and 10 it won't get 19 uh, 4 and 4 and 15 as yes, we'll get 19 so it is 4 and 15 so value of x is minus 4 minus 15 by 3 minus 4 by 3 so it's because first coefficient is 3 so here would be we will be having minus 5 and it would be 1.3 minus 1.3 is the value of x similarly we calculate for y for y we have 4 so I'll write 2 cross 2 and uh, 12 so I'll write 2 cross 2 cross 4 4 3 is so this is 12 so we want minus 13 so for minus 13 how let's take 2 to the 4 4 and 12 so we won't get 13 2 to the 4 4 to the 8 8 and 6 so we won't get 13 2 to the 4 4 to the 8 8 to the 16 16 and 3 so it is minus we want it in negative so minus 16 and plus 3 so y is equal to 16 and minus 3 so first coefficient is 4 it would be 16 by 4 and 3 by 4 16 by 4 is 4 3 by 4 is minus 0.75 you can again plot the number line and you can tell the answer it is minus 5 minus 1.3 uh, 4 would be over here 0 0.75 would be over here so it is again x sorry y is greater than or e uh, greater than x it is not equal to y is greater than x so y is greater than x is the answer next question so we have here 5 252 so again x again y so I just generally what I do is I'll just factorize it for some time so it would be 2 126 263 so 63 we know the number it would be 2 cross 2 into 7 nines are so it is 7 into 3 cross 3 so this is this and uh, it, what we want we want minus 32 so we'll just check how um, 2 to the 4 4 and 7 3 is a 21 okay it would be a bigger number so I will just try to combine the smaller numbers once uh, with 1 so 3 3 is a 6 6 2 is a 12 okay no it won't be so 3 3 is a 9 3 is a 9 9 and the remaining one no it won't 9 9 to the 18 and 14 ah yes we will get 18 and 14 it is minus so it would be minus 18 and minus 14 like this you have to check when there is a bigger number so the value of y uh, sorry the value of x would be plus 18 and plus 14 divided it, this is the actual value because the coefficient here is 1 let's see for y uh, for y we have 192 so I'll write uh, 192 I'll divide it by 2 it is 2 96 it will go by 4 no so 424 so now I know the factors so 2 cross this 4 I will write 2 cross 2 24 uh, I'll write 6 cross 4 so it would be 2 cross 2 into 4 into 6
1, 2, 3, 4, 5 into 6. So this would be there. So we have minus 28. So when we factorize it, 2 to the 4, 4 to the 8, it is 16. 16 and 12. Okay, it is there, 16 and 12. So it would be minus 16 and minus 12. So value of y would be 16 and 12. So you can plot it. x is 18, 18 and 14. And uh, y is 16, it is in between 12. So this 16 is the problem. 16 is less than 18 but greater than 14. So the answer is relationship cannot be determined. Next. So we have this uh, x, so again I have x, again I have y, for x I'll write 2 cross 2, for this 4, and for this 9 I'll write 3 cross 3, I want minus 9, you have to consider this sign also, I want minus 9. So it is, uh, 2 to the 4, 4 to the 12 and 3, okay, it is very easy only, so it is minus 12 and plus 3, so x is equal to plus 12 by 4 and uh, minus 3 by 4, which is equal to, 3 and minus 0.75 okay for y let's check it is 4 so it is 2 cross 2 and 9 is 3 cross 3 and we need plus 15 so we need a plus 15 over here so the same 12 and 3 but this time both positive 12 and 3 so value of y would be equal to minus 12 and minus 3 so minus 12 by 4 minus 3 by 4 so it would be minus 3 and minus 0 0.75 so let's plot you can plot and check if you plot you will get x as 3 and minus 0.75 y as minus 0.75 and minus 3 so y is equal to or less than so y is either equal to or less than x so y is less than equal to x or x is greater than or equal to y any, any way you can take so next question is uh, 5 cross 18 so sorry we have again x we have again y we have 5 cross 18 so 18 we can write it as uh, 3 is a 9 9 into 2 so like this we can write and we want 19 to be our answer okay so let's see uh, check it is 15 and 6 no it won't be okay it is 9 and 10 so it is 9 and 10 is 19 so x is equal to minus 9 and minus 10 so first coefficient is 5 so minus 9 by 5 minus 10 by 5 it would be minus 2 minus 9 by 5 it is uh, 1.8 minus 1.8 so similarly for y we have 2 cross 2 and 24 is 4 cross 6 this uh, sorry it is 6 and it is 4 cross 6 okay so it is 20 so we can divide it as 2 to the 4 4 to the 8 8 okay 2 to the 4 8 and 12 is fine 8 and 12 so y is equal to minus 8 minus 12 so first coefficient is 4 8 by 4 12 by 4 it would be minus 2 and minus 3 so let plot it and see x is minus 2 and minus 1.8 y is it is x y is minus 2 and minus 3 so it is equal y is either equal to or less than x so x is greater than or equal to y so it is the answer okay one more question is there i think okay we have next question eight question so again we have an x we have an y we would have 2 into 9 we would i would write 3 into 3 we want minus 3 okay In this you have to remember you have to see one thing that here it is minus okay so we want minus 3 so minus 3 6 and 3 it is minus 6 and plus 3 so x would be equal to 6 by 2 and minus 3 by 2 it is 3 and minus 1.5 okay but this 2 is because of the first coefficient okay second y y it is 2 cross 2 into 15 is 3 cross 5 and we want 23 okay so 23 this 15 and 4 no and uh, 15 to the 30 and 2 no uh, 6 3 to the 6 and 10 no um, 5 4 5 4 is a 20 okay 20 and 3 it is 20 and 3 so it is 20 and 3 so y would be minus 20 minus 3 first coefficient is 4 is the first coefficient is divided by 4 divided by 4 it would be minus 5 minus 0 0.75 we can plot a number line and tell for x it is minus 1.5 and 3 uh, for y it is minus 0 0.75 so 0 0.75 would be somewhere 
or between this two so it is greater than this and it is less than this so relationship cannot be determined no need to see minus 5 okay this next okay this was all about the quadratic equation if you like the video please click the like button and do subscribe thank you